Hello guys, welcome back to To The Max. Today we are checking out the new Halloween games in Adopt Me. Let's get to it. All right, well the first game we're gonna check out is this Magic Cauldron game. This one to me seems really hard because you only have two minutes to do it. And how many ingredients do you have to catch, Max Jr.? Three. Three. How do we know where everything is? Well, That's what I find difficult. Well, just in case if you guys didn't know, there are seven ingredients. Let's start with the simple small half glow mushroom, which is right here. Next to the ring. Oh, it's right in the room. Aha, uh -huh, yes, right oh. there. No wonder I can never find that one. Okay. Okay, now let's head over to cell number one. Okay. Into the magic Christmas area. Uh oh. This is the one I get in and I can never get out. There's <laughs> the tall mushroom. The tall mushroom. Oh, okay. there it is. So okay. it's behind sign. the sign. Okay. Yep. Okay. Right. Behind yeah. the sign, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's head okay. on out. Okay. Oh, I did it! I got out! Alright. That's like the first time I've ever gotten out of there. Alright, and so number two. Number two. We have the small mushroom or short mushroom. Okay. Like, the hint will be there's a lost block in this puzzle. Oh, okay. And oh, I see. There's, there's, a, there's lost a lost block. block. Okay. Okay. Oh, you're so smart. Okay. Perfect sense. Then there's cell number six over here. Okay, so we're up to what? This is the fourth ingredient or fifth? Um, this is the fourth thing. Okay. Um, there's the big mushroom right in this cage. Yep, I see. Okay. Is that is that a glow mushroom or just a big mushroom? That's just a big mushroom. Okay. Let's keep on going with the mushrooms down here. There's the tall glow oh. mushroom. Okay, I'm coming. Okay, that's where... <laughs> that's under the waterfall. Yeah, under yeah, the where... waterfall. So where the waterfall meets the pond? Yep. Okay. Okay, so you gotta go swimming. Yeah. Yeah, you might need to take it. A... Well, you will need to take it. A... <laughs> okay. Awesome. Now, let's move on to the true ferns. The ferns, okay. So let's start with the black fern, which is right here behind the Jesse statue. Oh, that's easy. Right out in the open. Okay, and that's the black one. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. And for the white fern, you'll have to take a dip again. I meant the white fern. Like... Yep. Okay. It'll be right near the entrance of the crypt. Ah, uh, yes. I see it. Right where oh. the no swimming sign is. Mm-hmm. Oh! Cool. Okay. This is making a little bit more sense now. Yep. Okay, excellent. excellent. So that's all seven? Yep. Okay, so if you find those items, you only have to find three of them, right? Yes. Each time. Yep. And what happens if you end up putting one wrong item in Pauldron? Um, don't worry, you'll still get some candy, but you will... Well, you'll get a dizzy potion. A dizzy right. potion. Okay. But you do have to finish and put three items in. So even if you put the wrong item in, make sure you continue on and put a total of three items in, and then you'll still get candy. Yes. Because mm -hmm. I've done it, and I only found two, and I got nothing. That's right. you got to yeah. make sure you put three items in. Even if they're wrong, you'll still get and, candy. And they say um, if you... Use some sort of speed booster, so like a hyperspeed potion or your honey candies or something. Or it candy helps. Corn. Or candy corn. It helps a lot because you only have two minutes to do all this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, go fast. Yeah. I usually do it in a minute. Nice. Usually do it in a minute. All right, we're back and we're going to try out this mini game of the potion yep. and give it a test run. Oh my gosh. I'm going to guess that uh, <laughs> Max Jr. is going to beat both of us. Oh yeah, big time. I'll be lucky to find all three, even though I've gotten the whereabouts of everything. Here we go. Let's go. do it. Okay. Black fern. Oh, I know where that is. Half glow mushroom, small mushroom was. 
Alright, I know where the black fern is. Okay. It's right okay. by Jesse. I just got the black fern. Yeah, I just got the the half glow mushroom. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna get to Oh, mushroom. Okay. Oh. Is the tall glow one in the, in the water? Yeah. And the normal tall one is in the Santa cell. Right. Okay, where, what else do I need? Uh-oh, I forgot. Okay. Small mushroom. Lost oh. block. That was... Oh, is it different with everybody? Yeah. Oh, is it really? Mm -hmm. Oh, everybody has a different potion to make? And I just got it. Yeah, I told, I told. And <laughs> 70 candy. I told you you were going <gasps> to beat us. 170 candy. Awesome. Okay, let's see what I get. Oh, you're done too? I did it. I got a ghost translucency potion and 170 candy. Oh, you're, I'm still I'm gonna coming. I'm going to drink it. I got 47 oh, seconds yeah, left. Let, let's drink our potions. Oh. All right. Coming in. Okay. And, and I got a candle summoning potion. Okay, drink and your potion. And 170 candy. Okay, quickly drink your potion. All right. Because I'm did. a ghost. There we go. Oh, you are too. <laughs> yeah. I love this candle potion. I think that it's really I, cool. That one's my favorite. All right, guys, we are here at the Horseman mini game. This one is really interesting. You have to try to catch the headless horseman and try to get as much candy as you can. But there is a little hack that we have learned. This hack is if you start really close to the front and jump on the headless horseman right away, you get maximum amount of candy. Before this update, it was 200 candy that you get now it's probably going to be more now that they've done this little candy update and we're being uh, rewarded for the outage so that's probably about 240 i think yeah and also you got to remember you gotta jump off your motorbike yeah you have to jump right off your motorbike and onto the headless horseman like right right away, away. yeah oh. And I know Max Jr. is pretty successful at that. I have only been successful at that once. Um, and I'm not very good at driving these pony cycles. And I've heard they are really hard to steer on mobile. So if you guys are on mobile, um, just do your best. And you guys will be rewarded for whatever candy you do collect. Cool. Yeah. That's a very cool tip. Yeah. Anything else you got to add? Um, and if you guys are not in a private server, uh, I think the earlier you get to this circle, the closer to the front that you start of the game. Yes, yeah. I believe that is true. Yeah, because I joined it like right at the end, like right before the game started and I was way at the back. And so there was no way that I was jumping on the Headless Horseman right away. <laughs> and then those pony cycles are so hard to steer. I'm very good at crashing into the ghost bunnies. The one tip that uh, <laughs> I can give you is that if you don't get them right at the beginning, is that you can jump off your motorcycle and keep jumping, and you can collect the candy fairly quickly. That's there, right. And there, if you have another speed potion and that sort of thing, then you can actually almost catch them. Uh, I've never caught them by running, but I've, it's really easy to collect the candy. And then just jump on the bike when you get closer to the end and go and catch the Headless Horseman. Yeah. Oh, and yeah. finish up the game that way. Yes. Oh, here we go. All right. We are here. Oh. And just the countdown of about 15 seconds and we'll be starting this game. Yes. And let's try that little hack. Let's try it. Absolutely. Who, who's going to be successful at it? I think I will. Thanks. I've used it many times, actually. <laughs> all right. I have never been successful. Here right. we go. Here we go. We're going on. We're all on the pony cycle. And I got him. I think I missed him. All right. Oh, I didn't. I did it. You guys did it. Awesome. Yeah. Two hundred and forty okay. candy. I'm doing. Oh, that's awesome. That's excellent. Yeah. I I purposely didn't do it because I'm showing <gasps> how to do it in a different manner. I'm, okay. I'm doing the run. 
Now I only have, I think, like three speed potions in me. Oh. Uh. Go, 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 Max go, Dad. go, go, Max Dad. You're almost there. I'm following you. Oh, he says you can't catch me. Oh, yeah. Max Dad will get you. Well, I'm going to get you. And if you hit, <laughs> as you're running and then you hit a, a ghost uh, bunny, then that just throws you back on the motorcycle. Yes, that's right. All I know is that I'm really good at hitting those ghost bunnies. Now that I'm back on the motorcycle, we should be able to catch them. Usually after the main bridge from the neighborhood. He gets a little slower. That he gets slower. Yeah, because he's tired. There, there we you go. got him. Good job. So my score was 3,900. We got 234 <gasps> candy. That's only six less than what we got. Yeah. So you, we are being paid way more. You get paid more if you get them earlier, for sure. Well, we got two, 240, yep. Junior? Yeah. Yeah, yep. Dad got 234. Yep. Awesome. Ow. Well, I was collecting a lot of candy by running. <gasps> oh, yes. That's fine. That's true. All right, guys. So these are the tips that we, uh, we managed to do and show you. Hopefully, they help out a lot with getting the maximum amount of candy the event uh, has to offer. And good luck. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Bye! Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and hit that subscribe button. Be sure to check out all our other videos. And hit the bell to never miss a video. Thanks, guys.